what's up you guys? It's Joe from Quarant Talk and this week we have a very special guest, Paige Anderson. Hi! <laughs> Do you want to show him your shirt? Oh yeah! Ta-da! <laughs> so this week on Quarant Talk I'm going to be asking Paige a few questions and then at the end we're going to discuss a certain topic. So question number one, Paige, what are some activities that you do? So I'm involved in the cheer program, the music program. I do the musical, Silvertones, dance company, and uh, I was on yearbook this year. Yeah, pretty much it. <laughs> Question number two, what is your favorite quarantine pastime? Okay, so I've been baking a lot. Um, that seems to be the common answer. Everyone's either baking or watching Netflix. I mean, like, I've been watching Netflix. I've been baking. I've been, like... I wanted to be like really pro like when this whole like thing started I was like you know what like I'm gonna be really productive and I'm gonna like do stuff that like I need to do like clean my rooms that still hasn't happened we've been we've had this we, the school has been shut down for like six weeks now and it hasn't happened but I've been baking a lot <laughs> what kind of things have you been baking okay so cookies brownies I've made banana bread a cake a cupcake cupcakes and um i want to make a pound cake but i've never made a pound cake before so kind of worried that that's going to turn out bad but might just have to go for it because yeah. we've ran out of options at this point question number three what are you looking forward to most after quarantine i mean like i really am just ready to like see my friends and stuff like i just miss everybody I, um, I also am, like, ready, like, I'm still holding on hope that we're gonna still get to do some of our stuff, like, from our senior year, like, for us, like, the musical, and, like, um, like, I'm hoping that, like, um, I can still go to Disney this summer and stuff, so I'm hoping that there's still, like, some fun things to look forward to after all of this, so just that stuff. So in light of COVID-19, a bunch of productions of certain musicals from schools were shut down, because when this all happened, that's sort of prime time to put on spring musicals, like the March, April, May time frame. And unfortunately, one of those shows was Sterling High School's production of Newsies, which me and Paige both were able to take part of. Um, so that's very disappointing, but we're still holding on hope um, that we can still put it on maybe in the summer or at a different time. But I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about that and see how you were feeling and talk a little bit about how I was feeling, so. Yeah, I mean, I definitely am, ho am hoping, like, we can still put it on because, like, it's not even the fact, like, like, we got the leads this year and it's not even the fact that like, I want to put it on because it's like, oh, I got the lead. Like, I just want to put it on because everybody puts so much hard work into this show and for it just to go to, like, I don't want to say like go to waste but basically like everybody puts so much time and effort into this to make it the best that it could be and then for us like not to even be able to do it and for people to be able to see it even if like we had to do it where like just the cast came in and we like recorded it and then like everybody like bought dvds or something like i would rather be able to show it in some way than just like not at all i just miss i miss the community like we yeah i agree from the from the main lead to the last member of our ensemble, like all of us just put so much work into this production and all of us do it with all of our heart. And to watch that all, like you said, not go to waste, but like not be recognized. Like there okay. are so many people that are never gonna know how the show was gonna be and how much work every single one of those cast members put into it. I just wanna wear the wig, sis. I was kind of vibing with it. Like at first, like to go from like, so I have always been like blonde, like I've never dyed my hair, never like anything like that. And then to go to like a brunette with curly hair and bangs, like that was just like such a change. And I loved, so like for the senior highlight thing, they were like talking about like fun funny memories. And like the, the memory that came to my head was when Younger was trying to find me that one rehearsal and he didn't realize that I had the wig on. So he's like going, Paige, Paige. And I turn around and he's like looking at me. And he goes, oh my God, Paige. <laughs> That was really it was funny. great like i really i really loved that so i'm missing the wig thank you. yep period ah thank you yep. that was beautiful so with all that said we basically just wanted to reiterate the message hold out hope and whether or not we get to do the musical we still had a great time putting it on 
and everything else that's being canceled um, or postponed or anything, just work to stay positive. I know that that can be hard, especially now, but just try your best. Yeah, definitely stay positive, guys. Well, that's all for Quarant Talk this week with our special guest, Paige Anderson. Thank you for joining us, Paige. <laughs> oh, thank you for having me. <laughs> So that's all for this week. Hope to see you guys next week with another Quarren Talk. And as always, go Knights. Go Knights!